You know, we were talking about that lineup last night that you guys finished with, and with Giannis at the four and you at the five. Why do you think that's having such success? Oh, I think it's situational. The Bulls have a lot of length and size, so uh, you know, Giannis down there helps count that a little bit. So uh, yeah, it worked out for us a little bit last night. We didn't get the win, but uh, we, uh, we had a chance. How were you? Uh, how was your energy from playing 39 minutes? You're not used to that. I felt great, man. <laughs> Uh, it was fun to be out there for that long, man, and uh, you know, trying to help the team win. Unfortunately, we couldn't get a win, but uh, you know, I think we built on what we did in game two. Yeah. And, uh, you know, so I got to the game to get better as well. This whole series is a, kind of an experience for this young group, but how important would getting a win be you know, to, to the add to that experience? Uh, it would be very important. You know, we want to win the game of the series. Nobody likes to be swept, so that's kind of my mindset. Um, with that young group on the court, would you see or feel the 11 to 1 run at the end of regulation? Did you tell that was coming because it surprised a lot of people? Yeah, uh, you know, I think Chris is a big shot, so you know, uh, that, that helped us out a lot. Uh, being out there in focus at the end of the game is something that we worked on a lot during the season. It kind of paid off for us to the regulation. John, that play, obviously we have a lot was talked about the last play of regulation. You made the handoff, kind of a quick look back. Did, did you feel that that was a pretty good Yeah, play? we got a little jumbled me, up. Me and Chris but, over thought the play because okay. we figured Jimmy Butler would uh, play the handoff, which looking at film, he didn't. So he he did came, not. Yeah, he could have came off clean. And, you know, was, he didn't play the yeah, handoff. Yeah. It was just part of the, part of the process of learning uh, you know, from it. But, what, what about just your activity? You know, what, what's getting you some of the good chances around the rim? You seem like you're really locked in. Yeah, uh, you know, just kind of focused, ready to you know play. And, you know, playoffs of the new season. I think everybody's got a lot of energy, a lot of extra effort. It's going to be needed to be a team like the Bulls. I'm just trying to do, do my part. John, this team, you know, has not quit all year. You've had a couple behind the Miami game in particular. How does that kind of attitude carry over into an elimination game tomorrow? Over a lot. Uh, we, we think we're going to do is play a real fight. Unfortunately, um, uh, I have to bust up with us, but we're going to come out ready to play tomorrow. And, uh, and, uh, we're going to take some nice surprises. When you get matched up against Gasol, uh, that, that's a great matchup. There's a, a great player in this league. Uh, you know, what, what are you learning? What are you gaining from that? Gaining a lot, man, especially him and Noah. Just you know, their energy, you know, what they bring to the game. You know, guarding those guys as well. It's a good experience for me as well, being a young guy. And, uh, so, uh, what better post guy to kind of yeah. start your playoff, you know, run out of you know, Gasol or something? John, what do you think in the second overtime? You guys were so close, but it just didn't happen. Yeah, we broke down, man. I think we were a little tired. We broke down. We both fought through it. And that's what we did with the wins overtime game. We got to get better. But, you know, by the first night turned over, and we were tired. And, you know, we were, I'm sorry if this is asking for, but what was the power of that home crowd last night? Oh, it was great. Um, you know, it surprised me, uh, to be honest, but it was a great crowd. They were loud. They were into it. You know, I kind of was laughing. It's kind of like a college field. Where, you know, you got two sides of fans, and, you know, just cheering every bucket. So it was, a, it was a weird experience to take a piece.